Hi everyone! Hi! I'm Alexandra. And I'm Luna. And, and you're, you're watching, watching Trash Pop! Ooh! Alright everyone! Today, I just have to mention something really quick. Luna, I am living for this vlog! Thank you. Okay, everybody, I have been visiting Luna here in the Bay Area, and while I was here, we decided to go thrift shopping. We did. And we got some good finds, girl. We did. Luna, what did you get? I got this dress. It's not the prettiest dress, but it goes really well with this scarf. Yes. And I got a few different dresses. You're going to have to wait to see them all. But this little number is one of them. So Luna, would you like to tell everybody what our video is today? Five things you didn't know about us. Alright. I'm sure that you would all love to know more about us. Who? You probably don't want to know about who us. Who is Trash Pop? So today we're going to share five fun facts about each of us so you can get to know us a little bit better. Ah. Fact number one about me. My drag name is Alexandra McQueef. I chose this drag name after the legendary designer Alexander McQueen. I chose Alexandra McQueef because I love McQueen and all of his strange and odd designs. In truth, as my drag grows, I would love to follow in his footsteps and just recreate some of that strangeness yes. and, and it just very darkness in my drag. And that is why my name is Alexandra McQueef, if you've ever wondered. And I chose McQueef because, let's face it, I'm a goofball. You are. She's a goofball. So we all have a little humor in there. <laughs> Hi, girl. A uh, fun fact about me, we created three drag names for me. Yes. <laughs> we all know the Luna, Luna Soul. But we came up with two others. Uh, Marjorie de la Beau. I love it. I love Madrin de la Bear. Butter of the butter, pretty much. Butter of the butter. <laughs> and uh, Patricia Del Mar. Oh my god, I love that name. Yeah. Patricia Del Mar. And honestly, this woman needs more than one drag name. <laughs> all I have of the so much personality. That she has. Yeah. Yes. So, three names definitely suits you, and I'm sure as we go, you will have more and I will. more names. I will. It's going to just keep going. Yeah. My, my, I'm going to get up. Yeah, it's going to be long. Like the dick I like. Uh, Fun fact number two <gasps> about Ooh. me. No Je one probably... cares who the fuck she is. <laughs> You're a bitch. I kind of had that humor in there. Fun fact number two. Je parle français. Yeah, I, she speaks French. I studied French all four years in college, and I learned it in high school, too. So I would say that I'm fluent in French now. So if I have any followers who speak French, you should say something in the comments, and I'll be glad to have a chat with you. On peut barader un peu. She's good. Yeah. I'm all right. I want to go to France, though. We're actually planning a... Yes! Trip with our husbands. Soon to be husbands. We're going to make them plan it all. <laughs> Yes. With their money! Because, bitch, oh. we ain't making any money. Number two? Girl, I didn't think of anything. Girl, you're interesting. You want me to help you? Yeah. Oh, girl, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Number two that's interesting about me, I just got a job at Starbucks and like my coffee. I like my men. Expensive. <laughs> Like the other day, somebody was driving around in a Lambo, and I'm like, Daddy! <laughs> oh, I can't get this. I quit. I'm too much of a diva for this now. <laughs> uh, Daddy. In the reveal. Fun fact number three about me is that I'm a writer. I've talked about this a little bit in some videos, but I love to write poetry. and oh, you I write? Love... Girl. Well, she wouldn't know because she never reads anything that I Girl, read. I read your poetry book. I'm kidding. She did read my poetry book. And, yeah, I love to write. I actually want to be a writer. Um, that's what she's going to Columbus for. She's leaving I'm me. Going, I'm going to Columbus to study writing. And, yeah, I'm going to get my MFA there in creative writing and poetry. And I hope to just publish novels and write for a living, honestly. Wow. And on the weekends, drag. Drag, 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 drag. Because I love to write about gender, and I love writing about queer things, and I just kind of want to help champion those causes. Right, number f 
free for me. I have a slight sunglasses. I mean, like I just was wearing a pair. They're all slight. <laughs> yeah. I feel like it's almost every other week that I get a Snapchat from her with new sunglasses. Sun yes, yes. And I also have a really good habit of losing those sunglasses everywhere I go. Or some bitch breaks them. Those ones I was just wearing were broken. <laughs> <laughs> While we were doing some crazy lip syncs in her apartment, I accidentally stepped on a really gorgeous pair of sunglasses. You did. You broke another pair. See, I can't keep anything nice with Alexandra because I've you know what? She's sloppy. She's a slopabotomist. That wouldn't be the first person who called me a slopabotomist, and it probably won't be the last. Do you even know what a slopabotomist is? <laughs> <laughs> Sloppy bottom hippopotamus. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Only a hippopotamus will do. For fact number four, this is going to be a joint fact about Woo! Trash Pop, Luna and I. We like to name all of our wigs. From wig number one for both yeah. of us, we mm -hmm. have named every single one of our wigs. Which, we've talked about this a little bit, yeah. our original wig, mine was Shangela. And mine was Goddess. And although they're no longer <sighs> with us, they've ascended into wig heaven. With Glam Jesus. Praise to Glam Jesus. Praise to Glam Jesus. They were faithful. They were faithful and yeah. we love them. There's plenty of pictures of them online. There are totally. And occasionally, like in that one video, you see Shangela resurrected. Yes. Because she embodies the trash pop aesthetic. She, where do you think we got the idea? Our wigs are so ratty, we're like, trash. Yes. So you'll see her from time to time. This wig happens to be named Shakira. Shakira, Shakira. No, that it wasn't talk like that. <laughs> There's a she wolf in the closet. In the closet. <laughs> and we decided to call this one Sia. Yeah, real creative. <laughs> Girl, it's your wig. It actually looks cute the way you've done it right now because it's not all the bangs that's parted. I like yeah. it. Um, another fun fact about me, I love this accent nail that Luna lended me. It's everything. I want to point at everything with it. <laughs> you get a car, and you get a car, and you get a car. And for number five, I wanted to bring something a little TMI. Oh, I did not lose my virginity until I was 21 years old. I was a bit of a, a late bloomer. A late bloomer, totally. And I was really nervous and I haven't fully come into my sexuality. So I did not lose my virginity until I was twenty one in college. But I can happily say that I have been around the block now. No she hasn't. Okay, I've like stayed in the block. Girl, you stayed in the driveway. <laughs> 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 you barely walked out the so front door. Girl, it's like an old lady. <laughs> okay, so this is a scented fan that we got from Pier 39 in San Francisco. And it literally smells like an old lady. Which, by the way, why aren't you using this one right now? Because you're kind of... My right? Lady. Yeah, like, like this is entirely my, my old lady I look. look young, dumb, and full of cum. Fact number five about me. <sighs> I apparently have a lipstick problem. Oh my god, yes. No, it's not a problem though, girl. It's a collection. I recently bought, like, organizers for all my makeup, and, like, I was organizing it all, and then I'm finally putting my lipstick together, and I'm like, one drawer's not enough. No, but I love it. I like to call it Luna Soul's private collection, and anytime I need a lipstick, if it's not in my bag, she's gonna have it. Like, today, Always. I did this yellow lipstick, Yellow, I never would have thought to try it, but today I was feeling a little daring. And of course, my girl Luna has a yellow lipstick. Of course. Pretty sure you have like every shade at this point. I'm pretty sure, yeah. And the collection just keeps on growing. If I don't have this shade, you can use eyeshadow. Yes. Because <laughs> I got that. every color eyeshadow. I also have like a little bit of a tradition now that for gifts, I always get you at least one lipstick. You do, That's literally, yeah. That's I always do now. So those were five facts about us. I hope that you enjoyed getting a chance to learn about us. Please... Say some things about yourself in the comments. We would love to hear about you. And we'd love to you hear about... You are the people. What you you think are the children. So please comment below. Subscribe. Like this video. Tell me I'm pretty. Tell Luna she's ugly. Um, you know, just those kind of things. And with that, my name is Alexandra McQueef. And I am Luna Solmarin de la Patricia Del Mar. And, and trash, trash pop, pop is gonna, gonna make the world, world pop. Dicks out for Harambe. Dicks out for Harambe.
six of Harambe. He was a homie.